Hey guys, so Jane from Legion Gaming. In this video, I want to talk about a free DLC map that's coming to Battlefield 1 in December, and also that we can play Battlefield 1 in just under a month now, which is pretty cool. And free in December is the Giant Shadow map. They just put it under the maps list on their website, so I'm just going to go through this and sort of just give you guys the information on this map and a bit of the history of the map after that. So, prepare to take part in the Battle of Cell in the cold autumn of 1918. Here the fighting moves out of trenches and into open country where a massive crashed airship casts its shadow onto the battlefield. The British forces have broken through the Hindenburg line and are now in pursuit towards an important railway center. Fierce infantry and tank engagements ensue on the open ground and river banks alongside the Kato Wessing Railway where an armored train can still turn the tide. Giant Shadow will be coming to Battlefield 1 as a part of the free update in December. So. This battle is pretty cool. We can get a bit of an idea. A crashed airship casts its shadow onto the battlefield. So there's going to be a crashed airship. Maybe it crashes at the beginning of the map. Or maybe it's sort of just lingering in the air over the map, limiting sort of aerial gameplay. And then we also get a train center, which is pretty cool. So we get a train station and a crashed airship. This map sounds really, really awesome. And it, it, I'm just happy that they're giving away a free DLC map right at the beginning of the game. Rather than waiting forever to actually uh, bring a free DLC map like they did in Battlefield 4. So, the people who fought in this army were the British Empire, Canada, and New Zealand, and obviously the German Empire on the other side. This resulted in an Allied victory, and it was an eight-day battle between September 17th and 25th. And it was on the Sai River in France, so hence the Battle of Sai. And basically after a six day halt for preparations and an artillery bombardment, 4th Army troops attacked at 5.20 a.m. on Thursday, September of October. Infantry and tanks preceded by a creeping barrage, which is basically just when um, there's artillery strikes that go slightly in front of the soldiers who are running forward, and it basically just clears the way for them uh, so that the soldiers can continue to run forward, and that's actually pioneered by the Canadian Army. And they move forward 10 miles onto the front south of Le Cateau. The center and left of the 4th Army cr uh, forced crossing onto the river. So we actually might see gameplay on the river in this map. We got some river gameplay. We got some uh, train station gameplay. And obviously we got some open sort of field gameplay. So this map sounds like it'll be huge, but it'll have very distinct um, parts in the map that will sort of dictate how it plays. Fighting was particularly fierce along the Le Cateau Wassing Way Railway, so maybe this will be sort of like a metro within this map, and they could sort of recreate it like metro, which would be pretty cool. Um, metro sort of inside one of the maps, and then the outside of the map could be a different part, but maybe they could even have a team deathmatch that's just within the railroad part. So that could be really cool. And basically, um, the, you just continue to push these enemies back, continue to fight them until they beat the Germans and took over the area. So this will probably be added to the operations game mode, especially because they talked about progression in the description of this map. It says British forces have broken through the Hindenburg line and are now in pursuit towards important war. And this sort of just indicates that it's the end of the war. This was in the last 100 days of the war, as the war sort of comes to an end. If you guys did enjoy this video for more Battlefield 1 content, trying to maintain one or two uploads a week. For now, guys, upload format. This isn't exactly an extremely long video, but it was just sort of bringing you news, and I wasn't going to post a video during the week anyway, just on the weekend. So I thought I'd get this news out to you guys. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe if you are new here. That's what it is for you guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.